We are more often frightened than hurt and we suffer more in imagination than in reality. If a man knows not which port he sails, no wind is favorable. He who fears death will never do anything worthy of a man who is alive. Life is very short and anxious for those who forget the past, neglect the present, and fear the future. How does it help to make troubles heavier by bemoaning them? First say to yourself what you would be, and then do what you have to do. Curb your desire, don't set your heart on so many things, and you will get what you need. Don't explain your philosophy, embody it. I begin to speak only when I'm certain what I will say isn't better left unsaid. What man actually needs is not a tensionless state, but rather the striving and struggling for some goal worthy of him. When we are no longer able to change a situation, we are challenged to change ourselves. It never ceases to amaze me we all love ourselves more than other people but care more about their opinion than our own. If it is not right, do not do it, if it is not true, do not say it. The best revenge is not to be like your enemy. External things are not the problem, it's your assessment of them, which you can erase right now. Be tolerant with others and strict with yourself. We have two ears and one mouth so that we can listen twice as much as we speak. No man is free who is not master of himself. A ship should not ride on a single anchor, nor life on a single hope. It is the nature of the wise to resist pleasures, but the foolish to be a slave to them. If you want something good, get it yourself. No loss should be more regrettable to us than losing our time, for it's irretrievable. Man conquers the world by conquering himself. Steal your sensibilities so that life shall hurt you as little as possible. Better to trip with the feet than with the tongue. Humanity must seek what is not simple and obvious using the simple and obvious. Since every man dies, it is better to die with distinction than to live long. He with the most who is content with the least. The foundation of every state is the education of its youth. Poverty is a virtue which one can teach oneself.